bride to be ditches the natural look for heavy bronzer, groomed brows and sleek hair, as she attends the Queen's Christmas lunch wearing a brand loved by the Duchess. She's steadily working her way towards being a full-fledged member of the royal fold ahead of her wedding to Prince Harry in May, ticking off another box today by attending the Queen's annual Christmas lunch for the first time. So it's no wonder Meghan Markle has been making some tweaks to her casual California girl look to show that she left her Hollywood actress life behind for the royal of sophisticated royal wife. The former suit star, 36, was hawking the noticeably more groomed appearance as she arrived today with heavier bronzer and makeup, ultra-perfect brows and smoother, glossier locks. Her look was very polished and glamorous compared with her engagement portraits taken just over three weeks ago in which she looked much more bareback and natural. Wearing a pure lace and crepe dress by self-portrait, Meghan looked as if she'd been taking style and grooming notes straight out of the Duchess of Cambridge's handbook. The Duchess herself wore self-portrait to the London premiere of a street cat named Bob in November last year and is famed for her bouncy brunette locks. Of course, Nobody would expect Meghan to go for lunch with the Queen wearing the casual ripped jeans and untucked shirt she wore for her first official public appearance at the Invitos Games with Harry in Toronto. However the pure lace top and white A-line skirt of the dress is a more fussy than the classic, pared-back look Meghan normally goes for, signaling something of a style shift. Nikki McEwen, a makeup artist and TV beauty expert, told Female that Meghan has clearly had her eyebrows shaped since her engagement portraits three weeks ago. They look to me as though she has had threading with a brow tint and they have been groomed and kept in place by a brow gel, she said. I am sure she will be aware that any straight brow hairs detract from her eye makeup and she has definitely improved the look of her brow since the engagement. However, Stacey Whitaker, an award-winning makeup artist and owner of Pauf and Pinu P.S. Salon says the former suit star has gone a little too far. She explained. The pencil in eyebrow look does not suit everyone and I actually think looks too harsh on Meghan for a daytime look and prefer her more natural brows. She added, her eyes are slightly darker too and look like they have a little more liner on them than usual. Independent hair and makeup artist Maddie Pierce, who is also a lecturer in media makeup and SFX has worked with clients such as Eva Mendes and the Pussycat Dolls and says that Meghan agrees that Meghan has upped her beauty game for the occasion. According to Maddie, Meghan has kept her trademark natural shape for her brows. However, she has applied a highlighter under the brow on the brow bone itself which really defines the shape, she said. The royal bride-to-be has previously said she prefers the natural look and doesn't wear foundation outside of work, but that certainly wasn't the case today. Meghan looks like she has used creamy product to create a dewy glow over the skin, opting for a slightly heavier makeup than usual carefully bronzing and sculpting the face, she said. No doubt she stuck to her tried and perfected Bobby Brown foundation as a base.